Right, and the song aptly echoes it. Now that we found love, what are we going to do? We need money to sustain the love. <laughs> All right, then. Welcome to Heart Bay. Right. And today we're talking about, you know, if you knew your partner was involved in any corrupt practice, would you report them? I mean, such a sensitive thing, especially when it concerns the heart. I know what I will do or not do. <laughs> Bright is here. And um, we have this beautiful young lady with us here in the studio to discuss with her. And so I will introduce she's Adolphine Ama Sede. Segbedeku. Segbedeku. Uh, Thank you very much. That's a great name. That's a beautiful name. Yes. Yeah. I wanted to get it right. So I was just yeah. looking here. Yeah. All right. Mama, welcome. The, the, Thank the, the you. The only thing is that that name gets changed when she yeah. marries. Marries. Aww. Yeah. Mm. Would you keep it or you change it? You are happy to change it? Yeah. Oh, you want to get rid okay. of your daddy? No, no, well, no. Uh, I, can, I can give you info uh, if you want it. <laughs> I'll think about that. <laughs> <laughs> right. All right. But um, are you particularly interested in the finances of your... We'll also share our opinions on of this. Of course. So, yes. Are you particularly interested in what your, uh, your partner does, how much he earns, whether he brings home... Are you particularly interested? Um, yeah, in a way, because um, biblically, mm -hmm. when you get married, you and your husband are one. Okay. So it's just good to share like what you earn so that you can plan as a family what to do with the funds that you, you both acquire. Mm. Yeah. Okay. So you so you, you, you want to know uh, everything that he, he, he earns, including gifts that are given to him by friends and it, it's, everything. It's just good to know. Okay. It's good to know. Like it's up to right. him to decide whether okay. he'll tell you or not. I see. But it's just good that you both know. Mm. That way you can decide on what to do with the fund. Okay, I see. Great, mm. <laughs> great. So, um, assuming that you find out that your partner mm -hmm. uh, is uh, bringing in certain things, uh, home, uh, money, um, anything that you think is beyond what he can. He can buy. How worried would you be? Oh. Worried? It, it depends. Mm. If, if it's uh, frequent, if it's occasional, you know that, well, maybe he went somewhere and he was given that gift, mm. so it's okay. If it's frequent, to, mm. it depends on the business your partner is doing. Okay. If your partner is into a business where he's surrounded with friends, definitely mm -hmm. you'll be bringing in certain things home and like okay this person give it Maybe. to me this person give it to yeah. me and all that mm. okay but bright i want to get your opinion on this mm. uh, do you care so much i mean if you have uh, a wife or a girlfriend mm. or fiance and uh, they seem to have this money that you know it's not coming from me whether if they're a teacher mm. teacher or a nurse, a nurse. Do, you, uh, do you care are you bothered no no i'm not I, I'm, I'm not at all I mean, it, we, we we live in a world where I could be earning one city a month from where I work, but you know that apart from that, we do other things. So the nurse could be earning one city, but she could be getting some extra money somewhere. Yeah. So I'm not worried at all about what she brings home uh, in terms of money or whatever. So for me, it is not a, a bother. I want to pursue to know how much she's bringing home or what is in her bag anytime she enters the house I, 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 I don't think well, a, a lot I'm of women a lot of women i know care so much about if the man is taking care of them mm. is the man taking care of me mm. is he making me happy at home mm -hmm. because the point is they see once you commit to somebody you are in it together in any yeah. case if they're accusing him of corruption you are also corrupt yeah. because you're both like -minded. Mm. Mind, mind, mind as well you know mm. I, personally i don't think i would bother so much if the man is responsible mm. okay taking care of my yeah. and in any case what constitutes corrupt you know, what, what do you think constitutes corruption for anyone in a, in a relationship and your partner, whether it's living beyond their means, what do you think constitutes corruption? I think corruption is when it's, when you obtain something illegally in, uh, through an illegal means, then it's, 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 it's corruption. For instance, uh, if, um, if your husband is dealing in cocaine okay. or drugs, that's so a corrupt illegal. form of getting, getting money. Okay, okay, but then you, you don't see him bring home the cocaine. Coca -Cola. He's but not he taking comes home with money. A, a, a loads of money in 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 in, in, in sacks. Mm. Would you get worried about it? Yeah, I will. Um, He's a businessman. Mm -hmm. You know, he has a firm, 
Because uh, if you knew he was doing drugs, I doubt he would even. Uh -huh. but uh -huh. Because you know he's not he in He has a firm out there. So he goes to work in the morning and comes back in the evening. Then uh, sometimes you see loads of money mm -hmm. in Ghana must go back. Mm -hmm. yeah. You get worried about it? You would definitely know. Because there are rumors sometimes from friends mm. and from associates you know that this is the business your husband is into and you'll be worried because when you go out there oh this is a cocaine dealer's wife this is a cocaine yeah no I, I i i want us to to to, to stick to this mm -hmm. assuming there is no rumor like that okay. but your husband owns a company mm -hmm. you you're not sure as to how much he's paid by his own yeah. company yeah. Mm -hmm. and comes home with loads of money in bags how worried would you be and what would you do what would i do i think i would sit my husband down mm. and uh, ask him like honey this is the uh, money i i see like where from this money that's if your husband so because you know that this man he is can't this afford is, to have it. yes yeah, so definitely there so should in, be the first, in the first place as soon as you see him with that money you get worried yeah, I'll get worried. I would want I to know <laughs> I see. why you have that huge sums of money. Mm. Mm -hmm. Like, the, the there's going to be an explanation for that. Okay. Yes, yeah, so you just know. Uh, mm -hmm. Not necessarily worried as in I'm suspecting you into any but evil But you want to find out where the source of that yes, money. Yes, I, you know. I see. So that if anything happens, we are in it together. Mm. You know. Yeah, so, but, so would, but would you, you see, the question is, would you report them to the police? My. Would you give up? Yes, it's your husband. This is someone you share your intimates with. Right. This is someone that you possibly have children mm. with. Would you report them if you knew? After you have gotten you to know that to indeed know that, that money yes. you, you he brought home was from a cocaine deal yeah, okay, he engaged yeah. to. Okay, so f the first or is, contract killer. The f I wouldn't rush to go and report him. Okay. The first step I would take is to try to reason with him. Try to talk him out of whatever evil practices he's into. Okay. So I talk to you. You are my husband. I have to help you out, even in times of difficulty. So, mm. okay. So I know you're into this. You're into that. Let, let's let's work it out. Let's let's find a way. He of can't stop. There is a cartel. He if he stop. stops, <laughs> somebody will kill him. <laughs> okay. So now it's 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 then it means I have to make uh, strict decisions. I have to. Uh, 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 you so have that's to what we're pushing you to now. Yeah, you have to decide <laughs> if you really want this marriage, or you want your children, your family, or you want to sacrifice everything for this cut off. But okay. nobody knows. You see, the thing is that nobody knows. It is. It is that you're the one. Yes, we now to which I want to say a show far right. So you are in the marriage. Nobody knows. Nobody is suspecting. The police don't know. But you know this. Uh huh. So I know. Yeah. Just as I got to know. Someone else who is your associate, who you are dealing with, mm. yes. might also know. Okay. And and when you're arrested, I'm going to be a single parent because you're okay. in prison and so all that. So you're saying that you go, you, you go and report him to the police? I'm not saying I'm, go I'm going to report him. What I said was that the first step is that we work it out. Let's okay. make it work. And it but fails. But if it fails, mm -hmm. you're going to report then him. I, I, I'll not really report. What would you do? <sighs> mm -hmm. I'll just leave the marriage. Okay. Oh, okay. yes. Okay. And then okay. people ask you, what happened? Why did you leave? Why How can he? He will reason. He will reason. I'm not I'm not done. done. I'm, I'm not done. Okay. Beautiful woman. <laughs> eh? Of course. Eh? You have three cars. <laughs> yes. This is very And yet you're, you're and you have your left mind. your husband. Yeah. What would you tell them? Oh, definitely. They'll get to know. But, you know, he'll, he'll get caught up with the law. You, he'll, he'll be caught up. Like, okay. at a point in time, you know, you, you, whenever you do something bad, at a point in time, you get you get the reward. Yeah, you get the reward. Okay. So, he has to just reason up. Quit, quit. That's the best thing. If he can't, I would help. I'll mm. help him to quit. We'll go to all everything, whatever we have to do. Then you lose it. everything. Uh, perhaps you lose a three-bedroom house. Mm -hmm. You might have to go and live mm -hmm. in a compound are house. You, are you willing room? to? So are you willing to let go of all the money <laughs> to live report it. him? Mm -hmm. Because remember, mm -hmm. if he is caught, the law will strip him of every money that he's earned illegally. Mm -hmm. Yes. So will you want to go back to when you were walking from circle yeah. to? <laughs> my, my so, so he he knowing all the consequences. You in, you know in no, the you act. Know. We, he know it and he loving me as he claims because we are married yeah. he would stop because when you lose all that what 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 what, what were you sacrificing all that for with mm. all the strong uh, but how about this other situation where you will be in the relationship and report him so that the law will catch and you will inherit everything <laughs> <laughs> that's a bad advice from the council but well, that, that's a good thing to do so, that see. is if he if he still insists on like this is a part this of what I want to do. this is what i want to do i'm not going to quit like 
Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. How would you then describe women, some women who are, 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 are referred to as they want comfort? Yeah. Because they want the comfort of yeah. Fasako Valley. They want the comfort of uh, uh, four-wheel drive. Yeah. They won't report anything like that. Yeah. They want to live with it. Uh, he knows, she knows what the, the, the husband is engaged in some uh, corrupt deals and mm -hmm. is earning money. But because of the comfort that comes with mm -hmm. it, she wants to live with it. How, how, how do you see such women? Okay. Well, there's just one word for them. Uh, gold, I guess, in a way. Because you got married to the person for money, mm -hmm. for comfort. So you're not really into the marriage because of the person. But you are in it because of the material things that the person has. And it's, it's a wrong motive in the first place. So you don't go into marriage because of your comfort, but because of the person. Oh, so the person. In this day and age. <laughs> in this day and comfort age. is like, it, it's, it's a factor, but yeah. it's not the ultimate reason for going into marriage with someone. Okay. okay. So when uh, you, you realize, so when you're in a, a marriage and because of all this comfort and all yeah. that, one day this person might be arrested and then, or, and then you lose the comfort, you go back to your poor state and then maybe you might even be arrested as an accomplice. You know? Just before uh, Bridget reads some of your text messages, there's a story of a young lady uh, yeah. who uh, had seen a guy. The guy was always frequenting her house in different cars. Today it is uh, a four-wheel drive, a very uh, plush salon car and yeah. all that. Now when they got married, the lady got to know that that young man works at a washing bay so the cars he was bringing to the house oh. was his boss. <laughs> so, so and the lady was just uh, uh disappointed. Totally, conduit, totally, know, right? totally disappointed <laughs> uh, that's yeah. a story i, I feel mm. like sharing mm. i'm sorry yeah. yes comments. yes uh, i'll just go on twitter and uh, read uh, i think two to comment this uh, from Osikani Yao in Japan says mm -hmm. that um, not at all, I will not report because <laughs> as long as I also benefit <laughs> from the corruption. <laughs> so um, I guess he's looking at his, his own circumstances and many others on Facebook. Um, Ajua, Ajua says, No, we are in this together and I will not report him. And Musa, Musa says, Oh, yeah, I'll let them go to jail and benefit. <laughs> You share, you, share, you share my idea. But uh, <laughs> thank you all so much for sending us your comments. Uh, thank you so much, Adolphine, for joining us uh, today on Hard Bay, mm -hmm. talking about whether you will uh, report your partner if you knew that they were involved in illegal or corrupt practices. Uh, but that ultimately benefits the family. Mm -hmm. uh, keep sending us your comments. We might just read one or two before we end the show.